you could combine a turkey, a peacock, and a dinosaur, you might get something that looks like this weird thing. You are bizarre. You might find them bobbing around in the rainforests of Australia and New Guinea. This is a cassowary. You're weird. And some people call it the most dangerous bird in the world. What makes the cassowary so dangerous? Is it related to dinosaurs? And what's that helmet-like thing on its head for? Don't make any sudden moves. We're getting up close with the feisty cassowary. The cassowary is an insular ratite, or simply put, a large flightless bird. It has a glossy black feathered body, a red neck waddle, and a bright blue face. 12,000 years ago, as humans began to evolve and adapt, most ratites had already gone extinct. The few that survive have exceptional grit. At two meters tall and weighing over 76 kilograms, the cassowary may not be the tallest or heaviest bird around. So what makes it the most dangerous bird in the world? A cassowary can leap up to two meters high with its muscular legs. That's about as tall as a horse. Its feet are equipped with three sharp dagger-like talons. Yeah, that'll do it for me. And the middle one can grow as long as 10 centimeters. When these angry, powerful creatures spring into the air, they can kick you with both feet at once. That blow could slice right through you, causing more than a few puncture wounds, bone fractures, and deep skin lacerations. But you would have to be extremely unlucky to get kicked by a cassowary. Usually, an angry cassowary will try to peck, headbutt, or charge you. The rest of the time, they like to mind their own business. These giant birds are shy and reclusive until you approach their young or enter their territory. Of the 221 known cassowary attacks, 150 have involved humans. And most of them happened because the humans seem to be refusing to give the bird food. Over the years, ill-advised humans have attempted to feed cassowaries. This has taught the bird to associate humans with food. Stay very still, Dad. This misunderstanding, coupled with shrinking habitat, is usually at the heart of cassowary attacks. But if you're still hell-bent on befriending a cassowary, you'll have to do better than throwing it some scraps off your barbecue. Unlike their ostrich cousins, cassowaries maintain their impressive bulk on a diet of rainforest fruit. That makes them the largest avian frugivore on the planet. Many species of rainforest trees would disappear without the cassowary helping their seeds to disperse. And if this bird keeps reminding you of this guy, there's an excellent reason why. Scientists are still working out the exact details of their evolutionary chain, but these big birds are the last living link to dinosaurs. The helmet-like cask on the head closely resembles that of a newly discovered dinosaur species, the Carithoraptor jacobsi. It's a modified cranial bone covered with keratin. That's the same protein our nails and hair are made of. They even seem to be putting it to the same use as their long-dead relatives did, communication. We now know that these birds use their cranial casks to capture and emit low-frequency sounds. Also used for socio-sexual displays, the cassowary's cranial cask is surprisingly flexible and leather-like to the touch. All right, who's been touching the cassowary's cranial cask? And although they're usually antisocial, cassowaries will hiss, rumble, or whistle at each other when absolutely necessary. But that's about as chatty as this bird ever gets. The only close relationship a cassowary ever has is with its father during the early part of its life. While the female cassowary walks out on her three to five eggs immediately after laying them, the male spends 60 days incubating them. Once they have hatched, young cassowaries learn the ropes from their father, following him around for up to 16 months. But that's a rare situation. Usually the father has had enough of the chicks after nine to 10 months. Then he chases them off his territory. Let's go, it's time to move out. Rainforest trees aren't the only thing that depend on ancient birds like the cassowary. Do you know that ostrich antibodies could help fight COVID-19? We've got that covered too in another episode. Slashing opponents with super sharp claws 
and communicating through their cranial helmets is what cassowaries do, and that's why they're crazy creatures.